IHTN Studios, it's Braves Beat. Hi there everybody, my name is Ben Bayless. And I'm Luke Johnson, here with your weekly news update. Let's jump right in. Your Indian and old Braves boys basketball team beat Madeira 55-45 last Friday night. Come on and support them again in an important homecoming game against Reading at 7.30. Don't forget that if you can't be at the game, you can always tune into the IHTN One YouTube, YouTube channel on your couch. And be sure to come out and support your Lady Braves basketball team and the future generations tomorrow for this year's future Braves Day from noon to 3 p.m. at our home court. It should be a great matchup against the Marymount Warriors. Speaking of girls basketball, Maddie Antonucci proved her ability to lead the girls basketball team yet again. She won the Cincinnati Enquirer's Player of the Week award and scored her 1,000th career point in the game at Madeira on Saturday. Be sure to congratulate Maddie and Cole on this major accomplishment. And also, great job to Indian Hills Aqua Braves last weekend at the Southwest Ohio Classic. Many of our swimmers and divers represented our school with wins. The girls team finished ninth overall and the boys finished 13th. The dive team also competed in finals at St. X and senior Lexi Megenheim finished 10th among all and Ethan Morris finished 15th. Way to go. Congratulations to coach Amy Dunlap for being recognized as the 2019 National Coach of the Year. Coach Dunlap helped the girls soccer team win back-to-back -back state championships. Great job, Coach. This is a very deserving accomplishment. Two weeks ago at the in-school duel, our IH wrestling team hosted Anderson High School, beating them 60-15. to Let's look at some highlights from this dominant performance. Good morning, Vietnam. We are out here at Indian Hill High School on the scene, and we are going to watch men hold on to each other in various ways. Let's get at it. They're squirming, squirming around. He has him pinned to the ground. He's not enjoying it. There we go. Why is this so easy? Personally, don't think violence is the answer, but I think in this sport, it's the answer. Just give his leg a nice big tug. Oh! Oh! Another body slam, perhaps? Today we're at a girls soccer meet. Um, hopefully they win this match. So guys, what do you think of this um, girls soccer invitational today? Uh, Anna Pilot is looking very strong. Uh, good moves from Kate Mars as well. Um, I don't know what John Mark is doing here, but it's cool because girls soccer's here. Trace Goodmore, uh, what weight class would you be in? The math class. <laughs> you know, Garrick, I'm just happy that we're actually getting some girls soccer coverage this year because we haven't had enough. Throughout my high school career, I agree. no mention of girls soccer. Now they finally get the praise they deserve. I, I agree with that. One mission! Dominance! Jaden Anderson! He's the guy! He is the man! The eater of dirt! Great job to all our IH wrestlers. Artists from Indian Hill High School and Middle School earned a grand total of 46 Scholastic Art and Writing Awards at the competition. Selected works of 32 students will be displayed at the Art Academy of Cincinnati. Great work, Braves. On April 13th through 14th, our school will be hosting a Relay for Life event. The event will last from 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. to raise benefits for the American Cancer Society. The goal is $100. Participants will also do fun activities like a dodgeball tournament. The last day to sign up is on March 15th. Contact Mrs. Kuhn with any questions. Her email is in the description below. Now, let's head over to commercials. The American do-rag has been a staple in modern society. Let's see a few of its many uses. One of the do-rag's many uses, it conducts heat. On a scale of one to Rolex, how icy are you right now? I got a lot of ice right now, I would say. Icy cold, it is so, it is so icy cold. Another benefit of the do-rag, it inspires intellectual growth. I want to learn! Did I mention it makes you stronger? And did I mention we be hooping, hooping? That is an absolute unit, oh my. Be sure to get your do-rag. The Indian Hill mock trial team once again excelled this past week. 
The black team won the Claremont County District Championship, and the red, blue, and gray teams all advanced out of Hamilton County. Great work, Braves. Attention. Winter homecoming is tomorrow. It will be at the Indian Hill Winter Club and runs from 8 to 11 p.m. The theme is Winter Wonderland, so make sure to be frosty. Tickets will be $30 at the door. We here at Braves Beat hope you have enjoyed this short four-day week, as we all had Monday off in honor of Martin Luther King Jr.'s courageous life and legacy. Be sure to follow us on Twitter, subscribe to us on YouTube, and email us with any school updates. Don't forget to come to the game tonight. And as always, stay, stay classy, classy Indian, Indian Hill. Hill. All right, I'm here on Braves Beat Trivia here, and your mom has four kids. She names them South, West, and East. What's your name? What's Obama's last name? We're going to race Nolan, and you pass the person in second place. What place are you in? Um. You're on a race, and you pass the person in second place. Which place are you in? North. <laughs> First. Ooh. Okay, what's Obama's last name? I'm down first. <laughs>